Hey guys, Dean here from Big Dog Builds. Today we've got something super exciting in the workshop. This is our first e-venture kit from Carly USA. Today we've put this in a Ford 2019 F350 Platinum model. On a roll, here we go, here we go. Yeah, we winning by a landslide. Never see me coming on my landmine. Yeah, I ain't taking orders in command light. Yeah, you about to see me on demand light. You know on demand. If you ain't know, you about to understand. Yeah, I got the team by my side, right hand. Yeah, take it to a stream, you ain't seen it like that. Yeah, and it's the dream, and we coming for the bag. Yeah, and we ain't never going back now Future expediting, now we on the fast track now They won't lend a hand, now they see us on the map now It's time to act out Here we go, at the top of the class on the If you want to look up the specifics of this kit Carly and CJC Off-Road in the US have done some awesome rundowns We are super excited to get it in a truck finally here in Australia But being an electronic shock Tapped into the factory wiring on this vehicle is just next level. So it can adjust up to 100 times per second. You've got different modes that are in-cab control adjustable, being tarmac, off-road, sand, dirt, a few different modes there as well as um, adjusting the weight in the rear. So when Isaac's got the trailer on the back tomorrow, he's heading up the beach with this thing with his awesome boat. Once he puts that boat on the back, he can set the level of the uh, weight in the rear and this will adjust the shocks to suit and dampen the best way possible. So with the full progressive leaf pack in the rear added with the Carly long travel airbags and the boat on the rear set the shocks to the appropriate weight. I'm sure there'll be a little bit of a learning curve here for Isaac tomorrow while he's heading up the beach but once he nails that I don't think there's going to be any kit out there for your F truck that's going to ride the way this one does. The Carly Long Travel Airbag Kit has definitely been designed by a team that know what they're doing. We've, we've seen a lot of different air setups here in the Rams and other vehicles here in Australia and the billet components and the way that these airbags are set on the axle to the top mount using the bump stop delete here is, is very, very good quality. We've just gone for the manual inflation for stage one here due to timing, but down the track we'll add an air compressor on board and a full onboard air pressure control setup as well. So I look forward to showing you that one down the track. For this stage one rundown, we have run out a little bit of time. We would have loved to have gotten out, so we'll have to get Isaac back in to go out, hit some trails and really test out this kit and get a in more in-depth video. But for now, we've managed just to run down the road, do a little bit of testing locally, and we are very, very surprised with how good this kit compares to anything else we've ever done. Isaac wanted every upgrade possible on this vehicle. Because of the VDC conversion and the steering box that swapped over to the right because of the right-hand drive here in Australia, we weren't able to do a couple of the parts in the full kit, but with the low mount steering stabiliser, the panard rod on the front that's adjustable, and everything else, including the sway bar end links, this kit drives amazingly, and we are very, very, very happy with it so far. The wheel and tyre combo on Isaac's build here is a Method 305 NV. So this is an 18 by 9 Neg 12 offset. We've also gone and swapped out the lip bolts around the outside of the wheel for the matte black one. Becoming a bit of a tradition here for some of the big dog customers. And we're loving the um, difference every customer is choosing to go on the visual aspect of these builds. Isaac didn't want the wheels protruding outside the vehicle too much here for a few different reasons. So we've gone and uh, put the Bushwhacker smooth flares all around on this model. Getting the correct fitment for the vehicle with your wheel size, your tyre size and the lift kit is key. So this one being the 18x9 Neg 12 with the massive 37, 13 and a half, 18 did require a little bit of trimming, nothing too much. And I'm sure Isaac's going to go and test this one out. If we need to trim a little bit more, we can get it back in the shed and um, yeah, clean it up. We really want to add some front mud flaps to this and we've gone for the Big Dog Builds temporary rear ones for now. These are a great looking little option. 
keeping this kit fully legal on the road here in Australia is a big thing. So being in the NB2 category now, Isaac can be ensured that this kit's engineered, ready to go, and there's nothing else like it on the market here in Australia at the moment. You know how much here at Big Dog Builds we love our Carly um, pin top kits. This is the Kings 2.5 shocks. This eVenture kit is sort of next level again. It's not for everyone. It's definitely out there and very, very expensive compared to anything else on the market. But the ride quality and the adjustability inside the cab for these models is just next level. We hope you enjoy this first quick rundown on this eVenture kit. We can't wait till Isaac comes back in. We go over the whole kit, we add the air on board, we get off the beaten track and um, really test this thing out over here in Australia compared to what the guys at CJC Off-Road and Carly in the US are doing. We look forward to sort of comparing the different environments here. We may have some better beaches. I think you guys are winning on the deserts, but um, yeah, really look forward to bringing you more and more content on these awesome kits. If you've got a build in mind, anywhere from just suspension wheels and tires to the full Outback Tour or the full overlanding spec here in Australia, get in touch today, guys. Look forward to hearing from you. On the road, here we go, here we go. Hey. Then the factories have introduced their electronic shock packages that are found on razors. I don't know what this kid is. Today we're introducing a suspension system that combines them both and gives you a high performance off-road system. Carly Kings. E-Click. It's not Kings. Is taking your input from your brain oh, and the pedal, as well as the motion of the train and the truck.